Yo, 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 TNT, a dynamite, the explosive one. I'm the man, well, I'm, I'm going to be on the sticks on the gameplay here that you're watching here. But I wanted to try something different. Uh, it's not the, the end of my Hollow Knight, and, and, and I may even revisit uh, the Dark Souls that I've had in the past. But I wanted to try something different. I have a lot of uh, ideas that pass through my head and when I'm playing the video games and trying to relay the information I just feel like it doesn't come across half the time the way that I intend for it to so this time I'm doing what they call post commentary we're gonna see how this works but I wanted to read something very very Near and dear to my heart. I wouldn't say near and dear to my heart. This is going to come off a little odd. But I do want to read something that I found on Reddit to you guys. And uh, I don't know. We'll, we'll see how this works. I've got like all kinds of ideas. But we'll, we'll see. Anyway, this was posted by Throwaway Husband uh, about a month ago on relationship advice. Uh, the title of it is... Wife told me she wanted to experiment. I obliged, then she attempted to eat my feces. Now, I've referenced this before in our in in, in some in some crazy town videos, but this is an explanation to it. I've even said that I would reference the video in like the description. I never have because me and Jonas are lazy. Me being lazier than him. Anyway, let's get into our story. This is a throwaway account because my wife follows my regular account here. Uh, I'm a 28-year-old male. My wife is a 26-year-old female, and I have admittedly had very vanilla sex through our three-year marriage. We had our first kid about a year ago, and it seriously slowed down our sex life. However, a little under a month ago, she approached me about trying new things. She had been hanging out with a group of moms in our neighborhood, and one of them told her that she and her husband tried pegging, and it completely transformed their marriage. My wife told me that she wanted to try pegging, as well to spice things up. Uh, at first, I thought it was a joke, but soon realized she actually wanted to peg me. I had never done ass play before, and had always lived by the philosophy that the anus is slow, solely an exit. But my wife made it clear that this was important to her, so after a few days, I obliged. The next weekend, she pegged me, and everything was surprisingly enjoyable. Additionally, the week following the pegging was one of the best weeks we've had together since the birth of our child. We were back to our old sex life, doing things like having sex before work and even waking each other up with head. However, the next weekend, she told me she wanted to peg me again. I was slightly confused as to <laughs> why this week the sex was that the normal sex just wasn't cutting it for. But I agreed. This was when things took a bit of an extreme turn. During the second pegging, my wife was inside of me and she grabbed my hair, craned my neck <laughs> to the right, and pressed our foreheads together. I had never seen her take control uh, like this and thought it was very hot until she looked me in the eye and whispered, I want your shit. I pulled my face away and asked her to repeat and she said, I want you to shit on me. I pushed her off and I asked her if she was joking and she started crying. I felt like a fucking dick because she thought I was kink shaming her in, in some way. And in a way I was because I thought the request was far too extreme. I ended up leaving for the night and stayed with one of my close friends but didn't tell him what happened. After that incident, my wife and I hardly talked all week unless it related to our son. At the end of the week... I asked my wife to talk about what happened. She told me again that she wanted me to shit on her, and it meant a lot to her. I thought it was sickening, 
but she claimed this was her deepest, darkest kink. I couldn't understand how and why my shit excited her, but she insisted, and she had always wanted this. We fought about this for about a week, and after watching some scat porn and reading articles by people who also shared this kink, I tried to put myself in my wife's shoes. I told her that I would shit on her if it's what turned her on, and she was so happy, and even thought I was still complete, and even though I was con- completely nauseated by this desire, I wanted to satisfy her. That brings us to tonight. We were having sex for the first time this week when I regrettably confessed to her that I had to take a shit. She perked up with a smile, sensed my discomfort, and began stroking my hair and whispering encouraging things to me. This really didn't... (laughs) I still didn't really want to go through with it, but since I had promised her, I took my pants off and we ran to the bathroom. She got into the bathtub and I hung my ass over the side of the tub. I started pushing but unsurprisingly found it very difficult to successfully shit on my wife. I turned my head around to see my wife staring up and smiling at me, waiting for me to finish. With enough time, I had fin- I was finally able to get a turd to start coming out. I could hear my wife breathing heavier beneath me as my asshole started opening. However, before the turd was able to drop on her chest, I felt a sensation around my asshole. I turned around and saw my wife, the love of my life, the mother of my son, attempting to catch my turd in her mouth as it fell out of my ass. I was horrified that she would even try to do this. And I tried to pull the shit back into my body so she couldn't receive it in her mouth. Seeing what looked like an attempt by her to eat the shit brought me close to throwing up. As I clenched my buttocks together to try to keep the shit from reaching my wife, the clenching cut off a very small piece and I heard it land somewhere beneath me. Was I was too scared and disgusted to look at my wife to see what she had done with it so I ran to the other bathroom to clean myself as I was sitting in the other bathroom thinking about how I will ever be able to look my wife in the eye again I heard footsteps approaching my wife lightly knocked on the door I didn't respond and was on the verge of throwing up the more I thought about what had just happened She walked away, and then I got a text from her thanking me for fulfilling her wish and asking me to come to bed. I've been sitting here in the living room, typing this for the last half an hour, scared to face my wife. We have plans to take our son to the zoo with another family tomorrow, but I don't think I can look at her after what she did to me. I feel deceived and violated by the woman I love and trust. During our initial conversation about this, there was never a question that my shit would go anywhere other than her chest. She knew how uncomfortable I was with this in the first place, yet she still tried to push the boundaries that we had established. I would appreciate any feedback from anyone who has experienced similar violation of trust from a loved one. I'm turning this sub i'm turning to this sub for advice because for obviously obvious reasons i cannot tell anyone that knows my wife and i i know that some some of you may find this humorous but please serious comments because our marriage hangs in the balance now i'm not a kink shamer either so I don't really have any any comment or feelings about, you know, what she likes or what he likes. But it it, it is interesting to to think that people go through stuff like this on, on a regular basis. And yeah, I I'm I'm not going to lie, man. I thought it was kind of funny. A little stomach turning. And I apologize if you had to cut the video off halfway through. But uh I wanted to share that with you. And uh you know, I hope to share more. I kind of I kind of like this format. It leaves it leaves me the uh, 
the autonomy to to read and and sound like I know what the hell I'm talking about. I don't know. <laughs> Were you fooled? I wasn't. All right. Either way, this is TNT Dynamite, and uh, keep looking for the crazy town for new content.